Yo, what's good y'all? Welcome back to another video of Los Angeles Chargers franchise. We are 0-2 still, winless in this season. We had some good games though, like it hasn't been blowouts where it's like, damn, we just can't win a game. It's just been a late game situation where we couldn't pull off the win. That's totally on us. Um, I was checking out these contracts, so... Obviously, we know Derwin James needs a contract, and he's asked for uh, 57 mil. Over five years, though, so that's good. We're going to get him to he's around 30. Uh, number one, Joe Souls won't but he's 32, so I probably won't do that. Mike Williams wants a contract. He wants about 30 over three. He's 26. That's I would do that, but uh, Trey Turner also wants one, which I'm, I might. I don't know. I might be willing to do it. I might. I really don't know. 30, I don't know if I want to do that. Offensive line is just going to go away. It is, honestly. Um, Achenna Nwosu. That's a person we have to resign. 24. Superstar Dev. Devs are very important for me, if you haven't noticed by now. So, like, just off base of the floor. Achenna Nwosu. Possibly Trey Turner. Possibly Mike Williams. Probably not Linval Joseph. And Derwin James. So, Derwin James and Chandler Rosso are locked in. And right there, just alone, that's almost all my money, I think. How much money do I have? Like, 90? Yeah, I have, like, almost exactly 90. And he's actually for 90. Um, he's not actually for 90. He's actually for 57. And Chandler Rosso actually for 41. That's tough. That's really fucking tough. They're good players. They deserve it. That's almost all my money right there. And the rest are like, they can kind of walk a little bit. Because they're not. They're not really anything in this offense just yet. If you like see the players that are asking for money. And there's the players that ask for big money. Like, no one's really asking for over 10. Except like a rookie. Which, like, I'm not giving you over 10 because you're a rookie. Like, even this guy, um, the t backup tight end. Who, we don't know who he is. He kind of seems sucky. But he's asking for 7. Seven over three? I don't know. Yeah, like this rookie's acting for ten. I don't know why you act for ten, but you might not even get that. Justin Jackson probably won't even get that either. It's a tough thing to deal with right now. But what I might really do is you know, I might trade Mike Williams. If he doesn't get the dev up by week we have to trade him by week eight though. That's when the trade deadline is, right? Week 8? We would have to trade him by week 8 if we decide to go in this direction. Yeah, it is week 8. We would have to trade him by week 8. And that is something we have to consider with the money situation we have. We might just trade away some players. Like, some players with big contracts. We could check who has, who's eating our cap, like, as of now. Like, Joey Bose, who has five years remaining... It's not like eating as much right now, but in 2021, it is going to start. 20 mil, 28, 31. But he has Superstar x -Rack, so I really don't mind him eating the cap because he's a good player and he's young. Yeah, no one's really eating our cap, but in the long term, they are, you know? Like, we paid Kareem Hunt 40, which I do agree. This rookie, obviously, he's, he's going to get the money. But, you know, it's just, like, little things we have to get rid of. That If we're not going to be able to resign them, we have to trade them. I'm, I'm going to have to live with that. And maybe we might have to trade Linval Joseph now. Not not in this episode, but this season, once again, before week eight. We might package a deal for them. Maybe for some picks. Maybe for some players. But when we look on our team, what are we missing? I don't really know what we're missing, honestly. Maybe offensive line help. Uh, you could say receivers, because the only one that's gonna be leaving on his offensive line is Trey Turner, and yeah, once that happens, we just need like a right guard, and I think the rest of our line is all right enough. Rudolph is a sixty-seven, but he's a rookie, so he I think he could develop to something. And our defense, if we was to trade Linval Joseph, 
We do have people that could slide over here and possibly Romeo Quara. Even our backups are not horrible, but what we do need the most help is in cornerback. So it was a trade we love about Joe, so we would look to get a corner, but we don't know which corner we would be looking for, honestly. It it you know, it's it's a lot of variables in the situation. But yeah. Just tell me what you think. And yeah, we're gonna get into these upgrades. That was a little long rant. Not even a rant, it was just like a situation that we're kind of dealing with as of now. Um, our season's not going that well. We're just trying to get better, man. Just trying to get better. Gonna go with slot with this one. Hopefully, he gets some route running and three to short. I don't even know if we need a short. Eh, who knows? Justin Herbert. You've been playing a little iffy. We are gonna change sliders this episode. Because last episode got me really mad. We should have won that game against a football team. You kind of need that medium route up. Let's go strong arm. Please give me medium. Oh, you did give me medium. I thought it said short. So it looks a little better now. Uh, Michael Davis. Who was our top cornerback? You're not that bad. You're you're better of a man corner, but you're not that bad. I'm gonna stick with man. And you get three to man. So your man's in the 81 now. His owner's in 70, that's alright. So you're Adley. I don't think you've been playing bad for us, but I don't think you've been playing good. Your man is horrible, but you don't I mean, we call man on blitzes, but we should get that man up. I like going hybrid. And you get plus two to man, one to zone. That's good. Joey, well, not Joey yet. Let's go Josh Winters. You're kind of bad at everything. You can't really do anything. I'm going to go slot. I put you up plus two though. And plus four to man, one to awareness. Interesting. You haven't played a snap. And Joey Bosa. I don't think it really matters because you're so good already. Yeah. I guess block shed. It's just gonna be run stopper. It doesn't do nothing to your overall, but you have plus two to block shed. We like it. Moving on now, we are facing the 0-2 Patriots. I want to say Pittsburgh Steelers for some reason. Oh yeah, sliders. I almost forgot. I almost forgot to do the sliders. Um, yeah, I don't. I don't know. What do we need up? I think we're gonna put their QB accuracy down even more because he missed the one, two throws. I think he might have missed one throw and it was an interception. So I'm putting the QB accuracy down 23. I know it sucks. And we're going to leave our QB accuracy the way it is because we don't, we, we miss throws at 53 and they're making every throw at 20, at 23? What, 25 or 26, whatever it was before I changed it? Um, We have enough time in the pocket, I would admit. We're catching a decent amount of balls. Run blocking sliders. Do I want to put it up more? I just feel like we don't have any holes. I'm going to put it up by like three. Leave it there. We don't really fump. Actually, we do fump. We got stripped. But those are legit strips. I think we're okay in coverage. I feel like our pass covers go up like a little bit. Uh, I'll put it down. We'll put it down to 45. Um, the tackling can... Would I put it up? Let's put it up a little bit. Let's put it up to like 40. And pass block. Run block needs to come down. 
needs to come down. Fumbles could stay where it's at. They don't even fumble the ball like that. And I think it's good. Even with these sliders, do they they don't look like it's in favor of any well it looks like it's in favor of us, but really the game doesn't even go like that. <laughs> we play horribly. And it's not like I'm making bad decisions. I just feel like we play horribly. Um, do they still have Cam Newton? We are on the road. Did we play at home yet? I don't know. I don't really remember some of these past games. Yeah, I think I did see Cam Newton. Oh, see, I do want to say, I do appreciate the support I've been getting on some of these videos. Some of these videos have been doing really well for me in these past few weeks. Honestly, I really do appreciate it. I didn't mean to say that in the last two episodes, but, just, you know, I got caught up. I almost forgot to say it in this episode, but, you know, I'm saying it now. We do appreciate the support. It's really motivating for me. And we're just going to come out here and get a win. Our first win of the season. You know, we're playing, well, we're playing really bad. Let's hope we can do it. Not really good, but... Could be worse, right? Gonna run the ball in this first play. And that's actually a good run. A really good run. That's a bad throw. There we go. So on his feet. I like it. <clears throat> and he drops it. Maybe I should have won possession on that. Oh, he tore his leg, bro. Are you serious? This is horrible. This is not the way you want to start a video. Great. My mind is somewhere else right now. 56 yard field goal. With the wind pushing back. How have I. Oh my god, this fucking kick. We get the ball back, but. Like, I'm literally kicking it full power and it's not even registering. Good thing we got hit on that. Hike it. It's like I wait for him to get over there. And I don't like that shit. Like, I hate when, like, there's a cornerback running something. I literally wait for him. Definitely ready for this. Doesn't matter if you're ready for it. We still got the touchdown. Cream Hunt might be his third rushing touchdown on the season. I believe he has a rushing touchdown every game, if I'm not mistaken. That puts it 7 to 0. Um, good first drive, but we did lose Hunter Henry from, I said from, to an unknown amount of time from a torn label. Good tackle. Really good tackle. Come here. Good. Cam Newton not really taking many risks, just throwing it short, giving us the ball right back. I like it. Good first. Oh, good run. I like it. Good stuff. So I really wanted to run it right there, but I seen that formation. It was in. I was like, no, no, no. We ain't doing that. 
There we go. What a move. Now we kind of rolling a little bit. Looks like nobody was on him at all. I think he was in the zone. But then again, it looked like some type of man. Please do not double team in. It's literally the left guard is supposed to block that guy right there. The right guard is supposed to block that guy right there. That's all it is. Yeah, I really didn't do that. And I almost didn't get it because I just can't run sometimes. Cream Hunt, two touchdowns on the game. This is what we like to see. This is, we had, okay. I was going to say, this has to be a win. But this Patriots team doesn't seem horrible. They, I don't know. They do kind of seem kind of bad, though. To be really honest. Like, offensively, they didn't seem like they had it. And defensively, eh. I don't even know who's on this team like that, really. Like, I'm looking around. Not really seeing much. The most yards they had yet on one play. He's probably never gonna fumble. They went to the wrong um, route. The route that I was supposed to cover over the middle they should have got there. I was actually a good move. The handoff to Kareem Hunt. Check by 21, by 21, check by 21. I don't know where to go with the ball. Justin Herbert sacked. Brought down right at the line of scrimmage. Probably should just throw it away in that situation. Right up the middle, right up the middle, right up the middle. Overthrown. That's really an end. He really caught that, and I thought it was like a little bit pushed out. Uh, that's a little tough. The Patriots take over first and ten at their own 37-yard line. Are you serious? Where did that step on? Second and ten at the 50-yard line. I'm gonna say, come on. Like, he cannot catch that, but I, like, if I'm not catching that, he's not catching it. There we go. They just keep going short. Kendall has 17 yards. There we go. Herbert's pass complete to kind of need this first down. A seven yard gain on the play. And it's third down. I don't really like the routes on the field. Here we go. I had a one look. <laughs> if that didn't get open, I don't know who I was throwing to. Not the first ever. Good catch. Oh my god, I thought he was going to throw it too far. Not calling timeout. Just yet, at least. Now we call timeout. My look to run here, depending what they come out in. 
And if not, we'll just flip it to something. Do I like this? This could be kind of good. Y'all yeah, just blocked the right people. And yeah, I kind of did, but I couldn't really do anything about that. Oh, that was fourth? Fuck. I should let time run down. I kind of want to go for it now. Yeah, I kind of want to go for it. Could be a touchdown, and it is. You're not serious. You're not dead ass serious right now. Like, come on. Can we get this? We still have a timeout. We don't. There we go. Kareem Hunt. Third rushing touchdown on the day. If I had to guess, he's due for a dev up. He hasn't had really horrible games. Even though last game, he kind of did fumble for us. But he really hasn't had a horrible game for us. Seen that coming. What are we doing? What are we doing? What are we doing? Okay. I didn't know what we were doing for a second. Big hit by Derwin James. No fumble. We was right on that route, man. We was right. We was just out of reach. Oh, wow. I stopped running. We might have hit the quarterback by accident. We definitely did. I did say we might blow a lead. And they get the touchdown. Um, I don't know, man. Did, did, was that... Obviously, it was a bad drive because they scored, but I don't know. I don't know. That rough in the past, it was tough. That third down call, not third down call, but uh, that third down reception they got was tough. Yeah, it was just all tough, man. It was just all tough. Should be a first. Good catch, good run. That would be could really run all of them now. Finally, a decent run again. I feel like we've been getting these short yards, like these three, five yarders, which aren't horrible, but it's like, come on, I want more. It's a gain of nine. Brings up second and a yard. Oh my fucking god! Holy shit! Damn, we got hit so hard. Good stuff, Joey. Not really, because you kind of... <laughs> he kind of pushed you off. You're gonna celebrate on that, but he kind of, kind of handled you. Uh, no one's gonna catch him. That's horrible. Anybody gonna catch him? I 
kill Harry's pinter, bro, so. Now we want to blitz. That's uh, Julius Edelman's first catch of the day, though. Then there's like nobody blitz. Look, he stood in coverage. And like I said, uh, hope we don't blow this lead. I love to blow lead, man. Well, what can I say? It's just like that fumble was so damn, man. That fumble was. Looked like Kareem Hunt has uh, issues holding on to the ball. I believe that's three fumbles in three games. At the forty three yard line. Good stuff. Kind of running downfield now. Oh, I didn't even, man, I just waiting for stuff to get open. Nothing really got open. Good catch. I believe if we want to win, we need points here. Cream Hunt is hurt too. This is not good. Oh my god, that scared me so much. That scared me so much. Uh, Bruce Ribs, we're gonna sit you down for a little bit. Just a little bit. A little short of the first down marker. Should be able to get in with a run here, right? Try a little power play. Uh, Josiah Kelly making his way well, in the game now. And uh, did we get stopped short? Do I want to go for this? I think I kind of do. I kind of do. Believe we should get this. Please block the middle. And that we do, we do get the first down. Keep the drive alive. Gonna go with a half back dive on this one. And that we do, and that we get. So Justin Jackson, first rushing touchdown of the season. Uh, Kareem Hunt is gonna be up for a little bit of this game. Well, at least so far. Cause not that we don't need him, it's just that um, you have bruised ribs, bro. Have a seat. Rest up them ribs. Ice them ribs. You're gonna be good. And we don't really need you in right now because um, we're still in the lead. We actually did good. We did good. I think we didn't have him for that whole drive. We wouldn't have uh, scored, but you know. Good hit. He's about to throw it somewhere. Don't even know where. Mmm, you sneaky man. Yeah, see, it was so tough. I ha I gotta play that middle. I just I have to give that up. Nothing I really could do in that situation. Oh my gosh. Just not fast enough to go around the linemen. Yeah. 
for a Patriots. First and ten at the 49 yard line. Another scream. This time I got him. Oh, thank you. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> wow, why are we still on the? Why are we still on our feet? Like, what the fuck? Like, come on. I'm so tired of being like tip plays and them not coming up with interception. I think I should put true clock on now. This might just be the end of the game for real. Wow, that looked like it was P.I., like a lot of P.I. So we're going to punt this ball right back to him. Uh, not really a successful drive. This kick might be way too far. And it is a, a little less kick power. We would have had that at a good punt. But it's 28-14, two minutes remaining in the fourth quarter. Um, they don't need a miracle, in my opinion, to get this off. Definitely need a miracle. Need, we we'll need to score really fast and keep all your timeouts. Newton's pass complete to Zay Jones. Like, we're gonna give you everything over the middle. That, yeah, good luck. You're down to like 50 something seconds now. And you still don't even get out. You know, you did go to the sideline, you didn't go out. Big hit. So the clock finally stops at 30 seconds. <laughs> Uh Kenneth Murray on the coverage. Did they get out yet? Nope. They had to go time out. So now it's time game over. We're finally gonna pick up our first win of the season against the Patriots. Putting them at 0 and 3, putting us at 1 and 2, I think. Are they really calling that? That's crazy. Sending pressure on this one. Big hit. Game over. Kenneth Murray Jr. coming up with the fumble. Drew Tranquil picking up the ball, and we're just gonna nail this and get out of here. A few questions after this game. Um, where is Kareem? No. Well, why did Kareem Hunt not come back in the game? I guess the game was kind of over by then. Um, when is Hunter Henry coming back? That's a big one. And when will? Justin Herbert play better. He's playing mediocre as of now. Early on, not early on, well, last season he played decent. But this season, not so much. I mean, 278 yards, no touchdowns, no, uh, well, one pick. Cam Newton, 162, one touchdown, one pick. It's like, I don't know. Uh, we, we're not playing that good. Uh, rushing, Kareem Hunt did have a good game, 97 yards. 
three touchdowns. He would have came back in there. He definitely would have had over 100 yards. And if we never fumbled on that play, we did fumble. That would have had over 100 yards. So Tony Michelle didn't rush the ball that well. 12 for 60. I mean, 12 for 60 is not that bad. Justin Jackson came in the game late with six rushes for 16 yards and a touchdown late to put it up by two scores. Uh, Dorian Dale, really good game. Seven receptions for 108 yards. Zay Jones had nine catches for 68 yards on touchdown. Joe Reed, five catches for 62. Kareem Hunt was a big focal point as he had five catches for 52 yards. And... That's it. That's it, really. Uh, defensively, I have some fumbles and whatnot. Nobody really wants to see that. Good week three victory to put us in the win column. Let's check our division, though. I wonder who's what in our division as of now. And we are at the bottom of the division at one and two. We could easily sneak in. Oh, kind of sneaking. Uh, let's check how long Hunter Henry's out for. Five weeks. That's not bad, but that's five weeks without our, our best offensive player. So, you know, that's, that's a little tough. Next week, we do have the Bengals. And I think that's all we have to get to. Uh, frustrated receiver. Mike Williams is a frustrated receiver. Um, yeah, we know what he's going to ask for. I do understand. I do understand. I haven't been trying to get you the ball, but you know, I'm just like, it's, it's, it's difficult sometimes. But I feel like I have been getting you the ball. Actually, let's actually check that in the past couple weeks, and then we're going to just get out of here. Um, yeah, let's check the bot score for you. Okay, week one against the Chiefs. Let's see, Mike Williams, you had four catch for 82 yards. Okay, that's not, once again, that's, that's, that's a really good week. Next week against uh, Washington football team. You had five catches of 62 yards. Okay, not bad. This week. You had three catches of 24. Okay, so you just have one bad week and you're just like hey I want the ball more relax <laughs> like relax you're good you don't need the ball all the time but okay whatever but that's gonna do it for us um once again tell me who do you think we should trade for the people that I am willing to trade are going to be Mike Williams Linval Joseph and possibly Trey Turner. And the people that I want to bring back are Derwin James and Achen Nwosu. Because so, if I do get rid of those contracts with the three people I mentioned, did I mention three? Who else said Mike Williams, Trey Turner, and Lynn Vojo? Yeah, so those three. It, yeah, with those three, if I do get rid of the contracts, that would give us more money to spend to retain those two free agents. Because those two free agents are going to cost us around 80 mil. That's a lot of money. And we only have 90 mil. So we get rid of those contracts. We have more money. We don't know who's going to be in the free agency of next year. And we don't know what kind of... Well, we got to check what kind of draft picks we have right now before we do get out of here. Once again, I, I am prolonging this a little bit, but this is important for uh, the future of this series. Uh, we have a first round pick, and that's all we have. So we're going to have to possibly package some things with some bad teams. So once again, if you did enjoy, now we're really getting out of here. <laughs> we're really getting out of here now. Once again, if you did enjoy, leave a like, subscribe if you are new. And I'll see you next episode. But until next episode, peace. Wait. Don't pull the trigger, that's why I got niggas, he a shooter, that's what I pay him for What did you think, that I was gonna kill him, I got career worried about my